Don't do that. Go. Okay, so that's um, you. So this is the key. It's that's the power you. for all of this. So you just put it in and we then push it towards David, it on. David, you can't talk into it. And then um, this will light up. I know. This screen right here will start to come in. And then for the scenes, there's this list right here, and each number is a different cue, and each cue has a different scene for it. So in the top part in the scenes, it'll have the what? cue and then what number it is. No, so why? To go to that cue, what? you click the button go to, and then whatever cue you want. So the Percy, the original, the first scene. Uh, would be go to Q1 and so you hit this button right here after you click go to and then the um, whatever one on this list it is and hit enter and then the light for that scene will show up on the stage okay the walkie talkies are in okay and then um, if you want this if you want the stage to be completely blank you click go to Q0 and then enter and the stage goes black and then um, if you want to say, if we were in the sixth queue and you wanted to have a fade out, this dial right, this, um, dial right here that says, that label Grandmaster, you slide it down, so, and then the stage is slowly dark, and then if you want it to be black, all of a sudden, you click this, you flip this switch to block out. Right, say that one more time. Okay. So, if we were in the first scene, you'd set it for the first cue, which shows up like that on the stage. Mm -hmm. And then, if I wanted to, so after the scene, there's a fade out. So you, but so during the scene, I'll click go to cue two, but I'll, I'm not gonna hit enter because that'll change the lights on the scene. So after the scene, I'll have a fade out, which. I'll have a fade out, and then I'll um, set the next cue, and then I'll when I fade it back in, it's the next light. Right. <clears throat>